welcome back to a capital adventure. It's been a, a different month, our run of games, after we lost to Inverness in the Betfred Cup and to Celtic in the league. We then went on a drawing every game, one an nil nil and two one ones. We then, I think it must have been the uh, World Cup was on, because we had no games in November either. We had a friendly against Ipswich and we won. Standard. We then kind of lost to Villa United in the friendlies. We drew with West Brom in the Man City under 23s, and they are Man City under 23s. So we then finally, after so long, <coughs> two months effectively, got a um, win. I just completely forgot about what I was uh, doing there. Ryan Longman and Mac Ashmore. Max Ashmore and the dying, dying embers of the game. Our dynamics is everything's good. We still have a few players that are kind of like, eh, maybe we want to leave. So, there's that. But, we're playing Hearts today. In fact, now. <coughs> so, again, where we are in the league is sixth. We're 12 points clear of St. John's uh, of Aberdeen. 9 clear of St. Johnson. They're playing Hibs. Wraith are playing Rangers. Aberdeen playing Motherwell. And St. Mirren are playing Kilmarnock. So, there should be a few losses in there, even if we do lose. Remember, this is still keeping us in this league at the moment. So, right now we don't have the, the worst of records. We do have a bit of a gap now to Inverness. We're not really sticking with the pack anymore. But, expected. So, let's get straight into, the, into today's game. Mali's just going to start just so it stops him. We did get rid of uh, Cordoso has gone. He's gone to Cambridge. Uh, Greenwood's going to come in for Stevenson because Stevenson's had quite a few, bit of a run. Story also going to come out for Max Ashmore because he's been wanting some game time Kevin McDonald will be, should be back ready for the Simmering game there's no one really else Clashen are still out injured Longman yeah take, be a buy off for Longman he's not really had any games but he's um, there and thereabouts <coughs> apart from uh, Ryan Blair who is now wanted by almost everyone uh, yeah we'll go again uh, like I said, I'm not expecting a great deal. I do apologise if I sound kind of like... Bleh, bleh. Well, something wrong with my throat. I kind of really sound uh, ill. Oh, as I yawn into the mic. That's really unprofessional of me. So, up front they've got Ikpi. I'm just going to call him Ikpi. Ikpi Zoo. Ikpi Zoo. Um, yeah. Him and Bugara, uh, Bangura, Claire, Mengnis, Guy in midfield with Hugan, Galloway, Callard, Lewis in defence with uh, Brush, uh, Boucher and uh, goals. And of course for us, apart from Greenwood and Ashmore, we're unchanged with James Wallace, Jack Hamilton, Mali, Blair, Waters, Gordon, Welsh, Watson and Zhao in goals. So we're going to just keep going. Again, I've been getting offered jobs down in England. Uh, Burton wanted me. Peterborough wanted me. I'll turn down, of course. You come into this one having struggled oh, a little of late with your opponents running across the press about bad day the office. Um, somewhere, and hopefully it'll be today. Uh, we're in good shape, we'll try and get a player what we have now. Um, see fair offers, yes, we're looking to sell, obviously. Yep, don't want to talk about people that are not here anymore. So off we go. Hamilton to Blair, I don't know why we're playing in our away kit, but anyway, Greenwood 
Oh, Ashmore does get there. Greenwood, this highlight is still going on. Hamilton, Watson. Are we getting a kickoff highlight? No, we're not. That's a shame. Nil nil. And there's a throw in. Waters to take. Finds Wallace. Oh, that's a bad touch. Magnus to Callard. Finds Ikpi. Ikpizu. Cross. That's a. Oh. Postalachi, I think that's what you would, how you would say it. Postalachi makes it 1 0 after 9 minutes. Disappointing. No one picks him up in the box. 1 0 Hearts. It's Hearts with a free kick. Again to Guy. To Magnus. Claire. Magnus, we are pushing him back a bit. It's a nice ball out. No one's there. Lewis. Clash uh, Mali with a charge down and interception. Blair to Ashmore. It's a long ball way upfield. That was reaching nobody. As a uh, Bouchure. Uh, Bouchure gets the ball. Ashmore does collect it. Wallace. Again, Wallace not really into this game. Watson charges it down for Ashmore. Cross. Wallace this time will run onto it. Can he cut a ball? He spends too much time. Mali. Wallace Greenwood's there, Greenwood again, Greenwood makes it 1-1 in the, I, I have just realised it's also an Edinburgh Derby, so Reese Greenwood, Rees Greenwood makes it 1-1, James Wallace does kind of make up for his earlier mistake, here, he could have cut that in a long time ago, Mali, it's a nice ball, Greenwood just does enough, takes from underneath his feet and sticks it in the back of it and it silences the Tyne Castle fans, Hearts 1, Edinburgh, oh we've, never mind, We've got a kick-off highlight. Two of our players goes charging to press their guy. Uh, Notts, don't do it straight after the kick-off. Not one of these ones, Lewis. It is one of those ones. As Postlachi, make sure it ends after a minute. Ah, dear. Yeah, no one even bothered to tackle anyone. I don't know what Mali's doing. I don't know where Waters has disappeared to. Yeah. 2 1 Hearts. And it's Magnus with a free kick. He just drives it. Zhao. Good save. <clears throat> Fortunately, it's probably going to lead to. This is probably going to be 3 1. As much as I really hate to say that, Blair does get rid of it. And then it does not. So, still 2 1 Hearts. And at half time, it's, it's still Hearts 2, Edinburgh 1. Yeah. I bet it's your better showing in the second half here, lads. I'll go there and try this again. Hearts to kick off. Last to um, I think that was Guy to Hugan to Galloway. Oh, sorry, it was Magnus in midfield, and it's still going to be 2 1. As uh, Magnus' free kick goes wide. Hearts come forward again. Like P. Waters does clear only as far as Lewis. Will he take a shot? He doesn't. And it's there. Uh, it is. Ikpi. No one picks him up. And that's what happens when your defence stands there and does absolutely nothing. And just watch this and just analyse this from here. It's a nice ball. Look at the whole defensive line rules and look where Ikpi is compared to the last man defender. To have slid tackled that ball. 3 1 hearts. And again they come forward, it's Guy. Gordon does sort of get rid of it, Tony's far as Magnus to Guy. Claire, Hugan, Welsh gets his head to it. Magnus, tackle everybody, Brenner on as far as Hugan, Guy. Hart's oh, passing it around, there's a fourth coming I think for them, here it comes. He's at the bar, watching to clear, only as far as for the corner. It's been tough. Magnus to swing it in. Welsh clears it, there's no one really there to dig the ball out. We have been absolutely battered. Still 3-1. Lewis to get the ball, Blair to take it down. Kicks it long, and really to no one, just clears it. Hearts defence get rid of it, straight back down. Wow. From our own clearance, guys. Oh. 
Yeah, we're not even. Yeah. 4 1. And Lewis with the free kick. And it's. Uh, luckily, it's offside. <laughs> Uh, I knew I knew this would be a tough tough season to step up considering our squad, but we're making really silly mistakes at the back. That's we're going to have to highlight that. I know we're in the transfer window. We have no money, so I'm just going to leave it run. Yeah, I can see we we are we're not we're still just I think we're just bottom of the championship at this moment with the players we have. Performing the way we're performing. With relatively League One players in League in the Premier Division, as it says a lot about where we are. At this point, I am really considering putting Blair Henderson on the pitch for Jack Hamilton. Look at that! Not even challenging for that, and that's a lone player for Brighton. Brendan down to Waters. Ashmore, Blair. Again, passing accuracy nowhere to be seen. That's going to damage them dynamics again. Why get Cameron, mate? Why what? He's got absolutely battered. Right, guys. I'll see you all for nine days for the uh, Saint Mirren game. Hopefully, that's a win. Hey guys, and we are back. We've got a bit of a... And well, we can play, can't we? Yeah, defensive midfielder. Um, McDonald's back in. And then... Uh, we do have Ashmore somewhere. Yeah, he's there. So, not fit enough. So we'll put Parsons back in. Take story off. There's been a bit of uh, news. Uh, Johnson can come back in for this one. Actually, me as well. Um, yeah, got some news on the old transfer front. In between, Lottie McLeod has rejected offers from three. Ryan Blair is now at Elgin City for the season. Sorry, no, he's not. At Cove Rangers. Uh, and Bottie Beabai is going to Falkirk in June. Because apparently, Falkirk are that bad these days. They want him for the championship, apparently. If he starts banging in goals, then I don't know. So, yes, that's a kind of stay home for the car. Um, yeah, the teams we were struggling to try and beat last season, they were in the playoffs with us, struggling. Anyway, that is it. We're playing St Marin, who are being absolutely dismal. They are worse than us. I never thought I'd say that, but hopefully, I would take a draw. But I would rather take the win. They've got a new manager in Craig Levine. So their team is Smith up front and midfield four of Naismith, Zoltic, or Zoltic, Brady and Canis in the defensive midfield role of T uh, Todd Bow. Defence of Aaron Sinclair, sorry, Taylor Sinclair, Cameron Leddy, or Leddy, uh, Harrington and... He's on obviously first team as well as Hamilton up, uh, Hamilton up front with Malley, Parsons and Greenwood in midfield, defensive midfielder of Kevin McDonald. So Kyle McDonald? I keep calling him Kevin for some it's Kyle. Uh, Waters, Johnson, Welsh and Watson in defence with Zhao in goals. So hopefully it shall be a outstanding game. Um He'll get a goal. Yeah. He's been arrested, nothing more. Let's get into it. And we're just going to, just for something here actually, I'm just going to cut it to the next one. But we just don't need to look at the top of the table anymore. And it's Watson to Welsh. He does it ahead of luckily Greenwood's there. Watson, it's all the time in the world to bring that down, Welsh. Person, uh, Parsons to Watson. It's nice and slowly, lads. Parsons, they're really standing off. Greenwood, don't take that early ball, just run with it for a bit. Watson's there. Uh, Watson finds Parsons. Welsh, Johnson trying to swap sides. Do finds Mally. Nicely done, Mally. Pings the ball in. Greenwood's there. Oh, Greenwood. Ooh. It's a corner kick. 
<coughs> Greenwood long ball in. And that's cleared and St Mirren have got a counter attack on here. Brady Waters does clear it away. And that's going to be the end of the highlight and it is, it is still nil nil. And Waters to Wallace, finds Waters again, with the header Parsons. McDonald's there. What can McDonald do with it? All the way back there to Welsh. A long ball down, Greenwood. Oh, across the goal, across the goal. Hamilton, Jack Hamilton makes it Edinburgh City 1, St Mirren 0. There's that all important little win against a team very much in the exact same battle we're in. And that's all that is required at this moment. As, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Waters, don't do it in silly with Zhao, kick it. Maybe not so much to Welsh. Okay, fair enough. Take it, Greenwood. Running and running and running. Hamilton. Wallace is open. Wallace was miles open there. Wallace, oof. Brady, this highlight is still going on. Waters, don't do anything silly with it. Johnson, same goes for you. Welsh. It's a long ball. There's no one really there. Sinclair. Taylor Sinclair. Cameron. Hamilton. Oh, he's going to make it two. He doesn't, but we do have a corner of it. I'm hovering over the pause button at the moment because I don't know when this is uh, going to end. Greenwood swings it in again, not really catching anyone. Johnson bringing it down again. Greenwood smashes against the St Mirren player. Welsh going to keep it in. Does, and that's the end of the highlight. 1-0 uh, Edinburgh. Yeah, that's half time. Uh, yeah, well, I know the, the issue in defence is uh, this man right here. <laughs> you see Ben Johnson getting a start, though. Um, yeah, come on, we're all over them. Still not happy with our performance with our lads. So we start the second half. We'll take that momentum from the first in. Watson, no, still 1 0. And it's Sinclair to Zoltic. Back to Sinclair. Naismith. Swings one in. Zhao. Yeah, get. No, I didn't. thought he got hand to it there. He didn't. St. Mirren with a bit of an intent there. Still 1 0 though. Waters has got the ball. He's been tackled. Oh, that's a red card. Oh, dear. Jim Canis sent off. Still 1 0 Edinburgh City. It's a foot race between Taylor Sinclair and Hamilton as Longman goes in for it there. Can't get to it right to Flynn. To right. Brady. It's a long ball. Wow. Oh, oh, he's offside. Oh, I was about to oh, I was about to throw the keyboard there. Jerry and Brady, it's a long ball. He is way offside there. Miles offside. That doesn't even know the offside is, but yeah, thanks game. Still 1-0, we're going to let it run for the last 5 minutes of the game. Uh, there's not a lot really we can do. Team's not playing too badly across the board. Um, it's more about consolidating a little bit now. We need to really be standing for him as Waters. Uh, uh, McDonald does get the head of that. Greenwood tries to find Longman. Can't. Probably should have kept in position. St Mirren really have turned on the pressure a little bit. Sinclair gets a ball in. And again, it's over the top from St Mirren. They're really trying to dig this one out now. We've got three minutes left. No, 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 no. Right, don't do it, game. Don't do it, Flynn. Oh, somehow we're holding on to a very slim lead. That'll do us no harm. 30 seconds to go. Just kick it up the field, Joe. Just kick it Jot to Johnson. Not ideally exactly where I'd want you to put it, Zhao. There we go. Longer ball. Make them have to come back with it. Hamilton's there. Watson. Anywhere down the line will do it. And there you go. We've... Uh, keeping ourselves in this league little by little. Yeah. I'm going to say we've got Wraith next. Wraith. Or can, if we beat Wraith, that's 29 points. We're... We've only got 19 games left in the season, 26 and 19, yeah, 40, 52, it's doable, 
we are pretty much almost guaranteed safety. I don't want to say it yet, I reckon it'll be about February, March before we can safely say we're not coming out of this. But St Johnson picked up a wee bit of form as well. Maybe just against a poor Motherwell side, but we do have a game in, set, game in hand over them. So, yeah, Wraith next. Not in this one, obviously. So when we come back, it shall be... <laughs> oh dear, it's Aberdeen. A good game, actually. Very well, because we need to come back. Just that's a quite a good game to have, along with it really should hopefully Wraith, but uh, we've got Wraith near the end of the season. So yeah, come back for Aberdeen, and again we've got to try and shut up shop against Rangers, and then you know we're coming back into some important games on the back end of the season. But until then, guys, I will love yous and leave yous. Remember to like, comment, subscribe below. Till next time, bye for now.